Hello, this is MakerJ101, and lately I've been playing around a little bit with um, Wireless Energy and Jewel Thieves. This is a Jewel Thief that I built. Um, I call it a, wi a Wireless Jewel Thief, but it's basically just a normal Jewel Thief, except it doesn't have a Troid. Instead, the wire is just wound in a coil like this. Um, yeah, uh, I've got my transistor over here, and I've got a potentiometer. Um, and my LED, and it's drawing 180 milliamps at 1.5 volts. Um, so yeah, you can adjust it a little bit with this potentiometer. Right now it's adjusted at a pretty good spot. There's like sweet spots, see right there, it's pretty bright. Um, but if you take another coil, well this, I think these this coil has about 24 turns. Um, 24 turns of the red thicker wire and 24 turns of the thinner um, orangish wire. Um, I've got the thinner wire is actually connected to the resistor because it doesn't need to handle any current. Only the thicker wires, the ones that need to handle a little bit of current. So because the um, smaller gauge is only for feedback so it doesn't really need to. Um, now I've got another coil here that is also about 24 turns, maybe 30 turns, I'm not sure. And that goes to a um, bridge rectifier and then to an LED. But as you can see, the LED is not, let me see here, not on at all. But that's, and that's because this LED here is sucking all the power. So if we um, disconnect this LED, now that LED turns on and it's wireless energy. So, we can go about that far away, and we might be able to go a little bit farther away if we adjust it a little bit. Um, have to see here, Let's see if we can, right about there is perfect. Mm, we can go a little bit farther away. Oh yeah, about there. So that's about five inches, probably five or six inches. So I mean, it's not real efficient, but it works, and I mean, it runs off a very low voltage. Um, we can also boost up the voltage a bit. We'll boost up to about two volts. So it's at two volts right now. It's uh, it's off the scale. It's drawing. That's not. It's lying right now. 300 milliamps. Yeah, about 300. And we can go a bit farther now. About 8 inches, maybe. So, yeah, it's not too bad. And as you can see, when you're real close and far away, it draws different amounts of power. Not very much, but yeah. So, I thought that was pretty cool that you can make wireless energy and it's so simple. And it's fairly efficient, but I mean you can also, if you um, turn it at a 90 degree angle, it kind of, wait, this one doesn't really do that. Some of them, some, some of the ones I've played around with, when you're at a certain angle, they, it, it cancels out. See, like right there, it cancels itself out. So, yeah. And then right in the middle, it cancels itself out also. But then if you go a little bit past 90 degrees, it turns back on. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, and it was very simple to make it very easy. Just basically a normal jewel thief, except it's got no LED on the primary. And it's, yeah. You don't need to have this um, bridge rectifier diode here. But if you want to... If I didn't have this here, it wouldn't work if you flipped it over. So it makes it so that it's always getting, and it's also converting all of the power um, so that the LED can use it. Because the LED will only use um, when it's, yeah, going the right direction. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. I'll turn up the voltage a little bit more. Maybe 3 volts, or 5 volts will go all the way to 5. Uh, maybe not. That might not be a good idea. 
All right, it's at five right now. Well, you don't really get much more range. Something's doesn't sound good. Well, yeah. So thanks for watching.